In this video, we will show you how to work on your user stories with Capato Continuous Delivery. In a previous video, we guided you through the steps to configure Capato Continuous Delivery throughout the environments in your pipeline. As a recap, we have added three quality gates in the integration environment. A validation with Apex and a pull request for Apex code and a compliance check for profiles and permission sets. A developer in your company has been working on a user story in the Dev1 environment, where he has committed a new class and has enabled new permissions in a couple of profiles. He has also created a pull request. When he is done, he clicks on Submit. The quality gates for the metadata types included in the user story are displayed. This user story contains Apex code, so it needs to pass code coverage requirements, and the pull request associated with the user story has to be reviewed by the lead developer. Capato Continuous Delivery detects that there are profiles within the metadata selections, so before the user story is deployed, Capato will also run a compliance scan in search of non-compliant changes. The developer clicks on Submit Changes to kick off the quality gates. This will create a deployment record with four deployment steps, a validation deployment, a compliance check, a manual step, and the actual deployment step. Once the validation deployment is completed successfully, the compliance scan on the profiles starts. At the very moment it is completed, the developer receives an email notification, informing him that there's an action awaiting his intervention. Once he reviews the pull request, he goes ahead and updates the manual tasks to complete. If all the quality gates are cleared, the deployment to integration is executed. From the Pipeline Manager, we can see in real time how the user story gets automatically deployed up to the production environment. And on Sunday afternoon, at the specified time, the back deployment to Dev2 and Dev3 will take place. Ensuring all the orgs in your pipeline are in sync and up to date with the latest changes.